Let's solve this arithmetic problem. This is our first arithmetic problem. Um, the problem is done for better understand uh, arithmetic calculations in practice. And to solve this problem, uh, we have to denote uh, numerator of our fraction as a. It will be a and denominator our fraction will be b. Um, and we will solve a and b separately. a will be equal to the numerator of our fraction. Let's rewrite it. Um, to solve A, uh, we have to, we first have to uh, define and understand order of operations. Look uh, and watch our um, tutorial about order of operations in arithmetics. Uh, of course, first we have to solve what is inside uh, braces or brackets. How do you like it? Um, the second will be this operation, and third will be this operation. Um, obviously, seven uh, minus six and thirty-five will be zero point sixty-five divided by six and five plus nine and nine. Uh, this part uh, can be represented as we can represent this as a fraction and uh, we know that if we multiply both sides numerator and denominator of the fraction uh, answer will be the same it doesn't change so we multiply the both sides numerator and denominator by 100 it will be 65 uh, divided by 650. And if we divide both sides uh, by 65, it will be 1 over 10. 1 over 10 is 0 0.1 and A all in all will be equal to 10. 10. Uh, what about B? What is which is uh, in the denominator of our problem. Let's rewrite it. B is equal to 1 and 2 divided by 36 plus 1.2 divided by 0 0.25 minus 1 and 5 over 16 and all of this divided by 169 over 24. Um, let's give an order of operations here. First of all, of course, we have to solve everything uh, inside braces and um, once again, uh, watch order of operation tutorial. Uh, first, we have to solve this. Next, we have to solve this. Then we can, for example, uh, perform this operation, then this operation. And this division will be the last one. Uh, let's do it. First, oh, uh, here, uh, this will be, uh, the first operation will be 1 and 2 over 36 and if we multiply the both sides by the number 10 it will be 12 over 360 and when we divide the both sides by number 12 it will be 1 over 30 1 over 30 uh, the second operation uh, will be 1.2 over 0 
and um, if we multiply both sides, numerator and denominator by 100, it will be 120 over 25. Then we divide both sides uh, by number 5, it will be 24 over 5. Let's rewrite our uh, B and it will be 1 over 30 plus 24 over 5 minus uh, this fraction by definition of um, of fractions gives watch uh, our tutorial about um, features of fraction our previous tutorial uh, on arithmetics arithmetics and you will see how to do it it will be uh, first we multiply 16 by 1 and uh, write plus 5 it will be 21 21 over 16 and everything is divided by 169 over 24 um, then let's um, perform everything which is inside braces and um, we know that Uh, to perform what is inside braces, we have to find, first of all, least common multiple of these three numbers, 30, 5, and 16. How to do it in practice? Uh, again, watch our previous tutorial uh, about how to uh, find least common multiples and how to use it when you perform uh, summation of uh, fractions. 30 is uh, 2 times 15, which is 3 times 5. 5 is 5. Uh, 16 is 2 to the power of 4. That's why least common multiple of these numbers 35 and 16 will be 2 to the power of 4, which is 16, times 3 times 5. And this is equal to 240. Uh, that's why we rewrite 240. And if we divide 240 by number 30, it will be 8. So we write 8. If we divide uh, number 5, if we divide 240 by number 5, it will be um, 48. And if we divide 240 by number 16, it will be 21. It will be 15. Uh, so we write... 8 plus 48 times 24 minus uh, 15 times 21. And we write this. Uh, if we, for example, use calculator to calculate what is in numerator of our fraction uh, 8 plus etc etc it will be it will be 845 div uh, divided by 240 and if we divide we, we can uh, transform our division to multiplication by writing this and uh, here uh, we multiply the both sides by number 24 we will leave with number 10 and here 
we will divide the both sides by number 169, which is actually 5. All in all, we have 5 over 10, which is 1 over 2. This is our B. This is our B. And uh, all in all, we have to divide A. Uh, sorry. A by number B. And our uh, B is 1 over 2. And our A was 10. Our A was 10. And uh, we can write this as or 10 times uh, 2 over 1, which is 20. And this is the final answer for our problem. Thank you for your attention. Like us and subscribe to see new videos on Open Math Camp.